never happened to his predictability. The milkman, the paper boy, the evening TV. You miss your old familiar friends, but waiting just around the bed. Okay guys, I'm really tired, so let's just get to it. What's going on? There's a varsity football game this Friday at McCutcheon. All right, Mitchell, what do you got? Live United Day is this Friday, all school day. Good stuff, guys. Anything else? Travel Club's gonna meet 20th of September after school. Something about checked bags or luggage. Yeah, and there's a meeting going on for student council right now in Mrs. Warner's room. If you wanna be a part of the Young Republicans, you can pick up the paper outside Mr. Groff's room. Tyler's sale ends this Friday the 14th. I mean, I don't have any money, so if anyone's willing to buy me one, I'd really appreciate it. Looking at you, Chris. I don't even have a job. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like enough to me, guys. Bye, bye. Bear broadcast on three! One, two, three, bear broadcast! Woo! Can you believe this lady had the audacity to tell me her ice cream was too cold? Dude, that's nothing, bro. I got hit with like six cheeseburgers, no cheese, bro. Can you believe that? Man, our lives suck. Where did we go wrong? No idea, man. Yeah, can you just make sure the deposit's in there within 24 hours? Uh-huh. What? <sighs> oh, the places you'll go. Here we have Oscar Grimaldo after the other week. First question for you, Oscar. How has the season gone so far this year? The uh, season's gone good. We're 3-1. Uh, I think we've improved a lot from last year, and uh, we're only getting better. Segunda pregunta para Oscar. ¿Cómo el equipo ha mejorado del año pasado a este año? Creo que hemos mejorado en todos los aspectos del juego, y de veras le echamos ganas. Third question for you, Oscar. Uh, what do you think you're going to do to help the team against McCutcheon this week? Uh, I'm just going to have to play really hard. Uh, I'm going to have to go out there and perform 100% every single play and just uh, hope for the best outcome. All right, last question for you, Oscar. Do you think you'll break the record for most touchdowns in the season? Uh, well, I'm hoping for, but I'm not really focusing on that. I'm just focusing on uh, getting better from a team and uh, winning. But if it happens, and it happen if it happens, it happens, and I'll be grateful. Gosh, I'm beat. I just want to take a nap. I'm finally by myself. Wait, I'm by myself. I need to find Natalie. No. What? I'm up, I'm up. Hey, guys, come on, we need to get out of here. The heck is a polygro? All right, I think we need to go right. 
I think we need to go left. Okay, well, maybe if we knew Spanish and would've gone to Spanish club like I suggested, we would know where to go. Yeah, we get it. You wanna go to Spanish club, but I don't have time for that, and I don't even know when it is. Um, literally, all you have to do is go see Miss Cook. All right, guys, let's just stop fighting. We can go to Miss Cook's room and bring our $5 for dues. Fine, but we're still stuck in the woods. What's in a squela? So this club is for everybody. If you have an advanced skill in chess, you're welcome to come. You can play with people of your own skill level, but also the casual player can come. Somebody who has no idea how to play chess is welcome, and the uh, club members will teach them how to play chess if they don't know. Students do not need to bring their own chess boards. We're gonna try to get a few people to bring some in, and we also will probably set up some computers with some digital chess. Chess Club will meet every other Wednesday right here in this room, H140, and that will be just right after school. This is a club that has no dues or membership fees, just uh, bring a good attitude and a love for chess or a, a, at least curiosity for chess uh, if you've never played before. to have to eat today? Uh, something spicy. Would you like a breakfast? Sure. Oh, okay. It's too spicy. The deal with it. Uh, how, how was your day? Good. That, that's good? Yeah. Have you ever seen the movie uh, Herbie Fully Loaded? <laughs> Uh, it's a it's a pretty good movie. Yeah. Aren't you gonna eat your mint? Yep. Uh, <laughs> it broke in half. <laughs> so, what, what, do you work? Yeah, I work. Where do you work at? Uh, somewhere. So, that's that's a good place. Yeah. Is it, is working there fun? Nope. It's just work. Uh, I don't know how to finish this off. <laughs> I'm like, have a nice day. Well, thank you for the date. Have a nice day. Welcome back to Bear on the Street. This is your host, Garrett Yurik. Today we're going to look for Hugo, which is pretty much the main star of the show nowadays. He's in every video so far. Which is two. All right, let's go look for him. Have you seen Hugo? Oh, good God. Huh? No? Oh. Excuse me, ma'am. Have you seen Hugo? Oh, uh, what? Have you seen Hugo? Hugo? Hugo. Um. Hugo? I feel like I have. Have you seen Hugo? Huh? Have you seen Hugo? No, I'm not. Oh, my gosh. Trickling, have you seen Hugo? I have not seen Hugo. <sighs> too many. Dustin, where's Hugo? I don't know. It's from hiding. Okay. Mm -hmm. Have you seen Hugo? Oh. What? Have you seen Hugo? Who's Hugo? Hugo. Hugo who? Okay. Mm -hmm. Colton, where's Hugo? I don't know. Oh my goodness. Famous. <laughs> I love you guys. Have you seen Hugo? Not today. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Where? Where? He's here. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta find Hugo. It's moving around. Oh, there he is. Hugo. It's Hugo. Hugo. It's Hugo. Hugo. Yeah. Have you seen Hugo? I don't know. Hugo's really hard to find, man. I know. He's, he's, I don't know where he is. Yeah. You should probably check inside your shirt. He really likes to attack your nipples. Huh? We found Hugo. Yeah. All right. Um, remember, kids, don't invest in Bitcoin. And moving on to the next segment. LHS Lady Berry Swim and Dive Call-Offs will be this Thursday, September 13th, immediately after school, in Coach Knight's room, D008. If you're interested in swimming, cannonballs, or wearing a cool cap like this one, be sure to come. Preseason schedules will be passed out, so make sure you come. Bring a friend.
Thanks for watching this week's episode. Be sure to follow us on Twitter, like us on Facebook, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And make sure to head over onto our Twitter and participate in our Twitter polls. Yeah. Yeah.